Hey y'all, Kathy here with Irwin Manufacturing and I'm super excited to go over our new trailer with you today. Um, this is our chef edition of our OMG trailers. Um, most of our trailers are 4x8, this trailer is 4x11, um, but it is still under a thousand pounds and you still can move it by hand, so that's always the positive. So I'm going to start back here at the back of the trailer. So down here you open this door and you're going to have your propane holders down here. There's room for two propane tanks. Um, one will feed your griddle and one burner and the other one's going to go to the other two burners. Um, on here you will be removed before transport because we do not recommend you drive with your propane canisters down there. Up here you have your polyresin cutting board, um, which makes it nice. It's a nice prep area for you to cut your meat, your vegetables, all that kind of stuff. Up here you just have some extra shelves. Um, you can put stuff on top of them. They're very sturdy. It gives you a little shade back here if you need it. Or if they're in your way, they're just pinned in so you can always take them out and just do away with them all together. Over here we have our 36 inch flat stove griddle. It has the four burners. Um, also when you're cooking on it, we have a little drip section right here. So your grease is just going to drip right into this pan. When you're done, you know, you just dump it out. Easy clean up right here. Um, also with our griddle, it is vented in to our smoker. through about a one inch hole right here. So you have the propane assist in the smoker. And then you also have your firebox down here. So you can, you know, you can light a fire, you can smoke. If you don't want to smoke and you just want to keep food warm while you're cooking, your, your propane will help you do that. Uh, but the propane also will keep your, your smoker at temperature. Um, so with our smoker, it is a, it's a three rack smoker, two racks have full grates, uh, full holes in them. Um, the reason that we do the holes instead of the grates is because one, it's easier to clean, and two, with the holes, you can cook pizzas and do all kinds of stuff instead of just your normal barbecue stuff. But with that being said, there's plenty of room in our smokers where you can add rib racks and any other kind of racks that you want to get from your you know, barbecue store. So moving on down here, we have our uh, Santa Maria style charcoal grill. Now for those of you who don't know what that is, it is a, a charcoal grill where you can move the top right up and down. Um, these are really good for like competitions or you want to say you want to get that good sear on that steak, you put your steak in, you lower it all the way down into the fire, get that sear and move it up and cook it to temperature. Um, and then you just move it back down when you're done. So back here um, we have our tailgate which actually also works as an extra little table where you can put your plates, forks, condiments, whatever you want. Um, it just simply just pins in and pin in at the top. When you're using at the bottom, it'll pin in at the bottom. Um, under here, you have storage space under here where you can put a table underneath and you can stack stuff on top of it. Um, and your tailgate's going to keep it in. You know, I'm sure you want to probably run some bungee cords over it, but you do have that extra storage down here. While I'm back here, I just want to point out that you guys can see that we have a, this trailer hooked up to a Mini Cooper. So that tells you how light they are and how easily they can be moved around. We can move them with four wheelers, you know, whatever have you, um, because they are super light and they pull good behind any vehicle. So on this side, on the serving side of the trailer, you're going to have five steam wells that are going to work as a steam tray. Um, the middle three have burners underneath them. They have 30,000 BTU burners. So these burners will fry and they will boil. Um, the residual heat from these burners is what's going to keep your two outside trays um, warmed up. Back here, I forgot to mention you have a solid piece right here so you can put, um, you know, whatever you want, ketchup, mustard, kind of like this thing. It's, it's just here for extra room to put your stuff. Um, down here you have another polyresin cutting board. And then you have more storage space right here. Um, a little storage compartment where you can haul all your stuff so you don't have to put it in like a bin in the back of your truck or whatever it'll fit right up under here okay so back here you have your four compartment sink it does have the hand washing separator here it's made out of o22 stainless steel all of these things are, are a requirement in most states by the health department um, it all drains down into the 9.5 gallon gray water tank there's no plumbing inside here it all just drains directly down um, up here you have your stainless steel countertops you can have extra utensils or anything else in there um, Another good use for this is we use the 
With our sink, we like to recommend to use the Coleman hot water on demand system, um, and it'll sit perfectly right here. A couple reasons why we recommend that system is because you have cold water and hot water all in one. With the flip of a switch, it's gonna go from cold to extremely hot in about five seconds. It also has a nozzle that'll reach into this sink, and then it'll come with, or you can order a wand that'll reach into these, these, compart these compartments over here. Also, another reason why we like that is because it has a five gallon freshwater reservoir, um, which is refillable. So if you, you know, if you're at an event, you run out of water, you just drain this, fill up your fresh water, and you're still good to go. So down here, you have even more storage on this trailer. Um, also down here is where you're going to drain your sink. There's just a little plug that goes in here, and you will put a bucket under here, pull the plug out, drain your sink, dump it out, and be good. So here at the front of the trailer, um, your tongue is removable. You're just, you would just pull this pin out, unplug your lights, your tongue's going to slide right out. Um, that's good for a couple reasons. One, it's good for theft prevention, because if you're going to leave your trailer somewhere, you don't have to worry about somebody just backing up, hooking on, and taking it off, taking off with it. Um, and another reason is, if people are walking around, or even if you're walking around, you know, this is a, a tripping hazard here. So when you remove it, that's going to prevent a lot of that kind of stuff going on. Um, you just put your jack down, and your trailer's going to just sit there. Thank you guys for watching. Again, this is our chef edition of our outdoor mobile grills. Uh, you can see all of our trailers at www.omggrills.com. Follow us on Facebook at uh, Outdoor Mobile Grills dash OMG Trailers. You can also follow us on Twitter and Instagram at Irwin OMG. Thank you guys again so much. Feel free to share with your friends and family.